Welcome back guys to the Bureau XCOM The Classified. In the last episode we escaped Room Range. And right now we are in the Bureau base and Director Falk wants to talk to us, so let's go talk to him. What do you want from me, sir? You're not here in this facility by chance. I brought you here quite purposefully. I've been following your career for some time. You brought me here? I seem to remember it was me who saved your ass when hell broke loose. You may have arranged the ride, but... And I would have expected nothing less from you. I appreciate what you did back there, but I also expected it of you. I knew you had it in you. You understand that? Yeah, I think I see where you're coming from. You see some magic spark in me that the rest of the brass can't see. No, not the brass. It's you who refuses to see it. Ever since the loss you suffered. And I'm sorry for that loss, Carter, but I don't think you're meant to sit it out on the sidelines. I think it's time you got another shot at being the agent you were meant to be. You have been doing your homework. What do you do, just watch people for a living? You are right about one thing, though. I'm not gonna sit back while this country gets ripped apart by these freaks. That's what I wanted to hear. What's our plan? Our first order of business is to get this facility running at full capacity. I believe our best shot at defeating an enemy with superior technology is to take that technology from them and make it our own. And we got the facilities to do that? We're still finishing construction on the lab, but we've already got one of the best leading the team, Dr. Dresner. And he won't be doing it alone. I'm in the midst of organizing field teams to be sent on recon and recruitment missions for other specialists. I'm heading down to the ready room. De Silva will meet you there and help you assemble a team. Get moving. And mediating De Silva. All right, so the ready room is where we will be doing, or rather where we will be recruiting agents into our team, uh, choosing which, what class they are and what they wear. So on and Welcome so forth. aboard, sir. What do they look like? I heard some of them look like us. No way. I've seen them. They look like some kind of. I don't know, some kind of monsters or something. How's it and going, Agent are? Carter? In the ready room. Yes, Director. I'll tell him right away. Where is he put that radio? The old man just called down. Says one of the scientists is missing. Uh oh. Disappeared, along with his research in high explosives. Does Falk think he's gone rogue? Maybe. But we can't risk a panic. Nils is tracking him down, but you need to get a team ready to help. Quick and quiet. Okay, so I can select a team, and now this is where the recruitment. Recruitment thing comes into uh, focus. This is a list of available agents. Falk has gathered everyone he could find from all the agencies. All of them specialists, all of them the best at what they do. I have two guys named Barker. What the hell? Okay, so I have a scout named Barker. Actually, you know what? I am gonna run over the uh, customization real quick. So, what happened? So you can customize Carter, who's your squad leader, and you can have up to two squad members to go with you. Each one of them can be a different class. This guy is a... Uh, is he a medic? I don't know what class this is... Oh no, he's a support, that's what it's called. Alright, so you've got supports, recons, engineers, and uh, commandos. Yep, that's what they're called. Commandos. Each one of these has their own different skill trees uh, they can build into. The max, the, the max other agent rank is 5 though, so which is kind of stupid. But here, let's go customize Carter for a bit. As you can see, he has equipment, and he has five sets of abilities. Each one unlocked at a different rank. He has, you can see the rank up right over here. He's currently rank one. You get experience through you know shooting things, killing things, so on and so forth. Right now, we have new weapons. So you unlock all of these weapons throughout the course of the game. These are the weapons we start off with: the M1911, M14, uh, this thing, and the M8. 97 and this thing which is apparently a European 32 caliber machine pistol each of these weapons has their own uh, different situations that, ca that they can be used in this the rifle is pretty much the all-rounder this thing is more uh, these two are more uh, dangerous up close this thing is also an all-rounder but it's a pistol so it has less ammo so on and so forth blah 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 and of course we have this backpacks uh, we'll be coming into a lot of these later in the game each backpack has their own different bonuses the backpack that we can use right now doesn't have anything so what we can do is first I want to, I want to freaking <laughs> correct this glaring detail of having two agents named Barker. Uh, uh, how can I customize? There we go. I can change his first name. So I can change his last name. Hmm. What? Well, let's call him Jones. Quincy Jones. I have no idea who that is, but I think it's someone. I think it's someone famous. So now we have Kofsky, Jones, Son, and Barker. Hmm. 
Yeah, for this first mission, I'm going to take drone. Whoops. Okay, so he's got. As you can see, the customization options for the side agents aren't as big. They only have two equipment slots, a primary weapon, and a pack. And they only have three abilities. Ta-da! These things. Uh, there is a skill tree, but we'll, but we'll get to that in a bit. See, yeah, this, this is the perk tree. So we can... Doom, 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 doom. The, the abilities unlock uh, the higher rank the agent is. And you can unlock different perks that makes them, makes them all different. But you can only do it once. You're only given one point to assign on each, on either perk, and once you do that, you cannot reassign it. So if you want to actually reassign a different perk, you have to get a new agent and start all over again. Here in the customization op options, nothing, uh, not much you can do. You can customize your vest color. I like to go for an all black on Psalm. Uh, this is the vest. The white. A black shirt. Black pants. A stark white tie. No, a black vest. So this looks kind of like, oh my god, these guys need some sort of secret agency. <laughs> I like to do it with all of them, so including these guys. You might you might see me do this a lot. I'll try to cut this out a bit, but no promises, my friends. Whoops. And, uh, and of course, all of them wear different uh, sorts of gear. The engineers wear sweaters, and they carry these things. Their main weapons are the submachine gun, as, as you can see over there. Uh, they also all have different abilities and perks. The trees are all different for each class, as I have uh, so graciously uh, explained earlier. They only can equip machine pistols, by the way, these engineers. Uh, recons can only equip sniper rifles. Engineers can only equip, I think it's shotguns and rifles. And commanders can only equip standard assault rifles. You'll be getting more of these throughout the game. So let's go ahead and organize and customize these. The engineers who wear jumpsuits, I don't know why. But when I put it black, it makes it look like a suit jacket. <laughs> All right, black shirt, white tie, and this guy looks badass. And the last one, I don't like the, I don't like the com the, the the camo, the the friggin' camo, uh, friggin' uh, what's it called? Shirts that they wear. Doesn't sit right with me. Oh, here we go. Camo color. Oh no, I want this to be. To be stark black and wants to be stark something else. Just, okay, stark white. Fine. If you can be stark black too, and so can your belt be gray. All right. Okay, that's the only thing I don't like about the military. Uh, the the uh, freaking military camo because there aren't a lot of customization options. Rather than other things like the suit and the tie and stuff like that. Actually, you know what? Why don't we? Since you're doing that, let's, let's customize Carter. You can only customize his <laughs> clothes, you can't customize his name, so he, so he becomes someone else. And give him the same outfit as everyone else. So now we all look like. So I'll now look all like members of the Men in Black. I'm gonna bring along. Hmm, yeah, like I said, I'm gonna bring along Jones, and I'm gonna bring along Barker, mainly because these two guys, uh, the Commander and the Recon, have very good skills. And ta da! We have a team! Carter, I chased the infiltrator to the morgue. There's no way out of there. Wait for me, Nils. I'll get your back. I'll wait as long as I can, but we can't risk leaving him with those explosives. I'm on my way. Carter, head through the armory and take a left for the elevator. Oh, okay. I'll send your team up to join you. So, Damn you it, go Nils. Hold on. So you gotta go meet Agent Nils. You gotta go through the armory. And, uh, yeah. Gotta go through this, so this will send us to the Sky Ranger Bay and Attention, Code Photo Base 4. Sky Ranger Charlie 4 2 inbound with heavy casualties. Medical units in Bay 4, Code Blue. And Code Blue means someone has collapsed, most likely multiple people. Oh, look! It's the Sky Ranger coming in with injured dudes! Agent Nils is inside. He ordered us all out here. I'll handle this. Yeah, you look so darky. Okay. <laughs> I'm having fun because this, I'm confident because this is a game I have played before. Oh, I thought a guy was sitting in that wheelchair. Dear God. Okay, so he's in here. And suddenly I have a gun in my hands. Ta da! And. Oh. I have a. Oh, it's the same guns from earlier. The Silva, where's my team? The Silva. Suspicious music. He has a nineteen eleven, but I have a sniper rifle and a rifle. Oh, oh God! Christ, Nils. It's Nils. 
She's dead. Oh my god. Do not grieve. He died well. Shit. Why? Why kill Nils? Why attack our world? You do not understand. This world is no longer yours. Vagina mouth. But you will learn. Mosaic will teach you. What the hell is Mosaic? Mosaic is the truth that humanity shall come to know. It is unfortunate that you will not be here to witness it. Yeah, well I know one truth that you don't. And what is that? You're surrounded. There's my team.